Hey guys, what is up everybody? Welcome to a new video. In today's video, I want to show you how to make A to B transition, which is also known as a before and after transition. So you can see what you had before and what you have now. And basically in the process of that, you want to compare. And as a sample or example of it, um, I you might be able to see it in my previous video when I wanted to show you how I do my color grading. And today I just want to show you this trick, how I do it in a few simple steps. And uh, to be honest, it's not that hard to do in LumaFusion. So here is my project in LumaFusion. As, as you can see, this is my raw video with uh, initial colors which, which I have it there. And this is how I want it to color grade. But then I would need to make a transition, right? So I want to show it to you in a way that um, you can compare how it was before and how it's now. So to be able to do that, I'm scrolling back to initial video. And I say I want to cut it maybe four seconds beforehand. So I cut it here. And now in the middle, we have this section, which is going to be transition section, right? So I create a copy of this section here. And what I'm going to do next is uh, I'm click on my final clip, which is already color graded. and. I copy all effects of this clip and then I go in onto this transition section and I click on paste. So basically now this transition section has exactly the same color grading as uh, my final clip, right? What I'm going to do next, I want to create this smooth effect, right? When you can compare how it was before and how it's uh, now. So I click onto the pencil and go into the frame and fit section and click here on cropping tab. And what I'm going to do next, uh, I'm going to the first row, which is called left. So I set it for 100%. And what is important, I need to save this set setting, right? So I'm going here to the left and click onto the plus circle. So now I save this position. So this position means 100% cropping from uh, from the left. So it's uh, basically onto the right. Now I place my timeline um, highlighter onto the right in, in the end of this section and going back to the cropping um, uh, tab and I put left to 0% again, right? So it automatically been saved. And as you can see, as we go through this section, my previous video, which is not color graded, now been uh, blended with, uh, with new color graded option. So I'm going back here and that's pretty much it, look. So that's how this effect has been made. So that's helpful. That's really nice when people can see this presentation. And I believe uh, because it's easy to do, it might be helpful for you to, to repeat and uh, do it for yourself. I hope it's been helpful. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.